Hi everybody and welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for being here. Today we have a couple subscription boxes, a couple of fun things that I ordered, and a surprise. So let's get into it and check it out. Today we have the Southern Fleek bath box, the 180 degree box. I have a order that I placed that I was Instagrammed and I have a late arriving because they do drop ship separately and I shouldn't say late arriving. It's only like a week after my regular boxes drop ship from my FabFitFun add-on. So let's dive right into it. We will get right out of the way the drop ship because it's not super exciting. <laughs> the drop ship that I ordered. Oh yeah, cute. This was from the FabFitFun sale. I've been talking a lot lately about wanting some cute bags because we are no longer able to get plastic bags at our grocery stores anywhere, basically anywhere. They're doing away with plastic bags in my area. And these looked so pretty and cute. And if I can get them back <laughs> in their bags, so easy to carry in my purse, regardless of what size, I'm not opening them, <laughs> regardless of which size I pick, because this is three outings where I have a perfectly small bag tucked into my purse. They are by EB. I got them through the FabFit fun edit sale. They were not sold out in every color. This color did sell out. So you will probably see them again if you have any interest in them. They are super cute. Just one of the many things you can pick up in a FabFitFun sale. Next out, let's do our Southern Fleet box. This is my Southern Fleet box. You guys hear me wax poetic about it. It is bath bombs and bubble bars and shower steamers. It's handmade soaps and body butters and they all smell magically delicious. And gosh, sometimes magically delicious. They are from Nikki over at Southern Fleek. She has an Etsy shop. This is the bath box. She also does a shower box. She also does other independent items. Like I use her laundry booster. I love the laundry booster. I love the way it makes my clothes smell. I feel like the clothes are even cleaner. I think she uses borax in it, which is what makes it even more clean. This already smells fantastic. It always does. I will put my code Catherine down below, which will get you 10% off your purchase in her Etsy shop. We get a little bit of information about the things that we're gonna have in here. If I had to guess right now before I open anything up, I think it smells a little melony. I don't know what melony smells like. Melon-like. <laughs> oh, I see a tub of body goo and I just love her tubs of swirled, whether it's a body butter or oh, one of her body scrubs. They are always incredible. All right, first out. This feels like it's gonna be a bath bomb. It already smells incredible. This was the January box. Just so you know, look, it is a bath bomb and it looks like a snowflake. It says Snow Fairy Snowflake and it's shimmery. It smells so good. Shimmery Snow Fairy Snowflake bath bomb. This snowflake will make your water shimmer and shine. The sweet scent will envelop you while beautiful blue shimmery water soothes your dry skin. I don't know what the scent is and it does not tell me. It just smells good. Like I said, it's slightly to me sweet, but kind of melon-like. It's delightful. Next out, ooh, ooh, this is a hot cocoa bath bomb and it is in a bag. I'm gonna show you this before I take it out. It is a cup in a bag. While I'm taking it out, I will tell you it says hot cocoa bath bomb with marshmallow bubble bath. Just what everyone needs on a cold day, hot chocolate and a hot bath. Up top, it's got little marshmallows. How stinking cute is that? It smells like cocoa. Dissolve marshmallows, so they're up top. Dissolve marshmallows under running water for bubbles, then drop in the cup and the bath bomb will stream purple. It is totally brown, that is so cool. Remove cup after the fizzing stops. That is just gonna be so much fun. So the top part, you're gonna take that off and they're gonna make bubbles. And then the breast looks like it's just brown cocoa, but she says it's gonna be purple. And it smells like cocoa. Yay. Next out we have, what is this? It's huge. Oh my goodness. Southern Fleek Snow Cream. Ooh. Snow Cream Bath Bomb. This is very interesting. I'm fetching it out. So I wonder if this was always loose. I have to say it probably was because of the way it's sealed and I don't think I've ever received anything from Heartbroken so it must be the intent. Let's read. Scented in vanilla ice cream with four different color embeds inside. This amazing bath bomb will be a great escape from the cold. Just remove the plastic bowl 
after the fizzing stops. So yeah, maybe it was supposed to say one solid piece. It didn't. It doesn't matter because it's in a bowl <laughs> and it's wrapped in plastic. So it didn't bother anything else. And I will just pour that right in the bath and it will be delightful. Oh, wait a minute. It came with a spoon. That kind of implies that it is supposed to be and maybe you don't use all of it. I don't know, but that's super fun. I will play with it, it will be fine. All right, next out we have, I love her tubs. This is Snow Day Whipped Soap. I'm using a whipped soap right now that we got last month, the month before. It's a pink one, it smells delightful. I'm about halfway, three quarters done, so this will be next. You'll just take it off and then take this lid off. And then when you put this back on top, it'll just flip up. Oh, that is nice. What is that? Oh, I feel like I know that scent. I'm gonna have to edit this out while I sit here and think about it. That is, look, it's pretty. It's blue and it's shiny and it has the star in it. Snow Day Whip Soap, scented in serendipity. A bright, fruity fragrance. It's smooth and moisturizing. Great for shaving. Each soap has snowflakes on top. It smells so good and so familiar. So familiar. I don't know if it was one of her scents before or if it reminds me of something else. Since I am still finishing off my last soap, I put the protective coat back on this to help keep it fresh. And last out we have, it looks like another bath bomb. It looks like a donut. That is so cute, oh my gosh. It is blue and it has sprinkles. It's white on top. See how it's, blue? I hope that comes across. It is blue and then white on top and it has sprinkles. Oh, that smells kind of perfume slash cologne-y. Mm, that smells good. Fizzy bubble bar. Ooh, it's a bubble bar. I would have bet that that was a bath bomb. Cool, cool. So we're gonna get bubbles out of this one. This large bubble bar was created to dissolve easier than most. Super bubbly and scented in winterberry, drizzled with cocoa butter for extra moisture. The man version is scented in cedar and grapefruit. So there's a man version of the box also. Mm. That smells so good. So of course, once again, Southern Fleet Bath can't even oh, begin to disappoint. I can, I did not put that in there great. <laughs> that, it just smells so good. Between the cocoa and the fruity scents that she talked about, that explains kind of the melon scent that I got. There's a little bit of cologne scent, a little vanilla, and yet it all smells delightful. I can't wait to use it all. I love that in the winter, she adds the cocoa butter embeds so that it's also moisturized. Next, we have the 180 degree box. This is sent to me for review. And because we do that with CAF 15, you will get 15% off your first box. Ooh, when we open it up, we have our paperwork. Are those stickers? Radiant Love, I think those are stickers, that is fun. And then this says, hello February, 180 degree box. And it says about the February theme, February is on a mission to infuse your life with pampering and warmth. Love is not just an emotion, it's a powerful force that starts from within and radiates outward. And this box is all about taking care of you. And it is, I've often referred to it as my Mary Poppins box. It feels like the never ending box. We just keep getting goodies and goodies this is the first we have. They are Cryo Glam Ice Globes. I actually have some of these, so I will set these aside for a giveaway. I love them. If you're having, especially in the summer when it's really hot, or if you get migraines, if you keep these in the fridge and then you can take them out and you use them around your eyes, they feel so good. That is what they look like. See how they're glass, but inside they've got sparkles. They're pink, they're so fun. I really enjoy using them. I'm not gonna touch these because I am gonna go ahead and pass them along. They are super fun to get in a box. The paperwork says, the perfect addition to any skincare regimen, use this daily to stimulate nerves, exercise facial muscles, tighten skin, and reduce large pores. Next, we have Nourish Mantra Facial Serum, Urban Rani. Powerful blend of hyaluronic acid, niacinamide, and plant-based, AHAs. Okay, I'm not going to open this either. You guys will love this. It's something that I know everybody would love, but I can't use AHAs on my skin and it is sealed. So I want to leave it like that so I can pass it along because somebody's going to love this. 
This serum is jam-packed with nourishing ingredients to help your skin glow from within. Nourish Mantra's Fountain of Youth in a Bottle combat signs of skin fatigue due to pollution and keeps skin dewy, soft, and illuminated. The fast-acting formula targets blemishes and dark spots while imparting a youthful suppleness. Fine lines, wrinkles, and pigmentation are old news, leaving you radiant. That sounds lovely. Next out, we have the Power Crunch Protein Energy Bar in Strawberry Cream. That sounds delightful. 13 grams of protein, 5 grams of sugar. Yeah, that sounds yummy. So delicious, you won't believe it's good for you. This strawberry cream protein bar has a burst of fresh strawberries with a creamy vanilla twist. Smooth, creamy fillings packed with protein are held by light, crispy wavers. Enjoy this snack on the go anytime. I love to have these in my purse so that if I'm out there, it stops me from doing something bad I shouldn't do eating or drinking wise. Oh, look, an Izzy. This is the sparkling strawberry. It is no sugar added, no artificial sweeteners. These are fun treats to have around when you are dieting and being good, so much better for you than soda. Elevate your beverage experience with Izzy, a symphony of exhilarating flavors and just the right amount of effervescence that will dance on your taste buds. Unleash your party of sensations as you indulge in Izzy's authentic fruit juice blend kissed by sparkling water and explosion of bold, unforgettable taste. It is 70 calories. Oh, because it's 60% juice. Okay, good to know. Next up, wow, we have an Eclat Skin London Refreshing Hyaluronic Body Wash. Wow, that's a nice big one. Let's see what it smells like. As you know, if we're washing our body with it, it's gotta smell good. Oh, it does, very clean. Very, very clean smelling. I like that a lot. Radiate in the essence of true pampering, all within the comforts of your shower, as each drop of this elixir whispers tales of luxurious bliss and beauty of embracing your skin's natural radiance. Bathe in this hyaluronic acid-infused body wash that not only protects, but also radiates a bounty of moisture, leaving your skin irresistibly soft and smooth. Enriched with a blend of finely selected ingredients, including the skin-loving sodium hyaluronate, this body wash serves as your personal sanctuary, embracing the essence of self-care and self-love. Next out, we have Earth Harbor's Cacao Cove Detoxifying Indulgent Mask. Ocean Minerals and Raw Cacao. Okay, I, I, I am intrigued. The ultimate indulgence that harvests a nourishing feast for your face, tickle your senses, and intensely replenish your skin. This brown and white speckled superfood mask not only detoxifies, reduces, and enhances skin's overall appearance, but it also is a radiance ritual celebrating self-love and the bounty of natural skin care, so you can radiate your outer love and witness your skin reclaim its luster. So, a chocolate face mask? Is that what I'm reading? is absolutely what it looks like. Is it a powder? It looks kind of like a powder. Take one to two teaspoons of this and add water drop by drop until you have the mask you want it to be. Oh, when you open it up, it's right there. I'm gonna try and smell it without sniffing it, you know what I mean? It smells a little bit like cocoa. That is so cool. It has some vitamin C in it, but it, it makes me want to try it anyway because, you know, chocolate. Next up, we have candy with bearberry extract. It is a lip scrub, 100% edible. Interesting. This candy edible lip scrub will make anyone fall in love with glowing and kissable lips. Combat dryness and discoloration on the lips while also getting a delicious plump pout. Well, since I'm not doing sugar, I could not eat it, but it would not stop me from using it and then rinsing it off. When you open it up, it's a super cute pink pot. I'm having a hard time getting it open, but I can get my finger under it just to show you guys. It's like a pink scrub. It smells kind of like grapefruit. It smells really good, but since it smells a little like grapefruit, I'm gonna go ahead and read the ingredients before I use it, but I'm sure I can use it. And if I can't, one of my girls will love it here in the shower. This is by Minimo. I think our girl Jess over at Everything Proof, I think this is one of the brands that she puts in her box because she likes it. And just for the record, I just read it and there is no grapefruit in it, so I can use it. Next out, we have The Candle Company. I'm guessing it's a candle. 
watch it not be a candle. Wouldn't that be hilarious? It is a candle. Oh, it smells very nice. What is that? That is very nice. That reminds me of walking into like an antique shop where they've started a candle. Or, or one of the shops on Duke of Gloucester in Williamsburg. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's the one. It smells very kind of posh, but vintage, but clean. Let's see what they would like to say about it. TLC Candle. This heartwarming fusion of red currant, teak wood, and pomegranate entwined with the cozy essence of nutmeg and ginger will warm any heart and any home for a cozy winter. Let this candle illuminate your space, igniting harmony, love, and irresistible appreciation for life's simplest joys. That is a lovely scent. Does it have a name? Gatherings. Gatherings. It's quite lovely. Okay, next out we have by Mally. Ooh, something from Mally Beauty. Ooh, it's very pretty and it is a great color for me, whatever it is. <laughs> that is beautiful. Very pink like me. Bounce Back Rose Petal Blush. You'll adore the pop of color more than you think. Makeup buff or not, the Bounce Back Blush's easy to blend formula effortlessly gives cheeks a natural love struck glow. Whatever your skin tone, the wearable rose petal shade with a subtle, sheer, yet multi-dimensional shimmer won't budge so you can radiate all day. Oh, oh, I thought it was gonna be a powder. It's, it's cream. Bounce back because it's, it's like it's bouncy. That is so wild. It makes me think of Japanese cheesecake. You know that? Bounce. I know. It is a very unusual analogy. I just got a little bit, all of that bouncing. It's right here. I just got a little bit on my hand, but it's a great color. That is going to be super fun to play with. And our bonus this month comes in our little red pack and it is generally I don't know if it's always jewelry I think mine has always been jewelry and this is a rose quartz and lava bead diffuser bracelet so you can take those oils that you have all the essential oils and you can put it on this that is super fun for me because I use ylang ylang as a calming scent because if you have I know information you guys don't need about me if you have a heart racing situation Ylang Ylang helps calm it. I know, I didn't believe it in the beginning either. This is Radiate Love Rose Quartz and Lava Stone Aromatherapy Bracelet. Rose Quartz is commonly known as the stone of the heart as it channels healing energies of unconditional love, compassion, and peace. Radiate love and carry your favorite scent with you throughout the day by adding a few drops of essential oil to the lava beads. So you can see this is rose quartz. See right here where my finger is touching it? There are three lava beads. They're more white, they're more porous. That is where you would put your oil. And then on the back it is a metal that would just slide up. Let's see how it fits. Cause this looks really cool. It's easy peasy. Just take my fingers, and slide it up to make it smaller. And that is what it looks like. I mean, you could make it tighter even still. There we go, I have it even now. And so you would, with these three here, you would put your oil, whatever you wanted to. Ylang Ylang, or I love that this is clearly sized for most. If anything, I would say it's big enough for anybody. It might just run a little big if you had a tiny wrist. I only say that because my daughter has a very tiny wrist. And I did not even realize this part stretches. So you could probably, let's see, size it to fit you. So I made it as small as it gets, even from, yes. So you don't have to size it each time you wear it. It just slides right on. I love that. I am taken with this. I will be putting some ylang ylang or something else calming on this and I will be wearing it. That is our 180 degree box. See what I mean? It had body wash and a drink and a protein bar and the facial serum and the lip scrub and the candle and the cacao, what was it? Detoxifying indulgent mask. We had the ice globes for our eyes, the Mally blush and our bracelet. I mean, that is a fun box full of goodies. Again, I will put all of the information down below for this. With CAF 15, you will get 15% off your first box. Okay, let me show you 
how I was instant influenced. So there I was, <laughs> picture the scene, minding my own business, scrolling through Insta, looking at everybody else's pretty pictures, wishing I would do more on Insta. And I came across this. And it was a lady, probably about my age, except for she let her hair go gray, and it was quite lovely. And she took out, she had her little box, and this is from the, this says the Higher Five. Oh, it's the Higher Five. It's the name of the sample set that I got. It's from Higher Collective. I am in no way affiliated with them. I actually got on to see if I could in some way affiliate myself with them so that I could get you guys a discount code. I could find no way to affiliate myself with them. They are a B Corp. They're working in organic products. And the lady said, bam. And she had such a good Insta. This is, they do lipsticks and they're organic. They're so much better for you. I am always looking for the perfect lipstick to wear up here. I'm wearing a Ciati London that I have been wearing forever because I think it's a good color for me, but in my regular life and for I think $23, I'll put a link down below. Like I said, in no way affiliated, just Insta influenced. You get five of their most popular colors and a little lip brush to try it with. And I will show you, I'm gonna do the same thing that she did wish I didn't have a lippy on. I'm going to show you these lippies. So you get a lip brush. You can just make it into a nice lip brush. I'm going to take this lippy off I have on and hope it comes off nicely. I loved that every color looked fantastic on her. Granted, she probably had the skin that makes every color look fantastic on her. And I don't know that I do, but we're going to give it a try. So we have these five little pots. They say it's a higher collective can take the lid off and you just have, they've given you a sample and on the bottom, it has the color. So this one is called Chateau. Get a little bit on our brush. And these are organic. So you don't have to feel bad about the fact that I've always worried with lippies that you eat them. You just eat them all day, every day. This one is not a color, you guys can see, it's not a color that I would pick for myself. It is very close to my skin tone. I refer to these as um, concealer colors. It just, I like my lips to have a little more pop than this, but if you like this very natural tone, this is Chateau. I would recommend doing what I'm doing though, because I saw the lady try them on and they all looked so incredibly fantastic on her that I just knew they would all work on me too. And I suspect she had one of those universal skin tones that looks good, whether it's neutral, whether it's cool or warm, it didn't matter. They just all looked good on her. Okay, let's take this off and move on to the next darker one. Of course, I am taking off all of my makeup around my lips too. I believe this to be the next darkest one and it is called Blue Jeans. And I think this one is going to have another leaning neutral tone toward it. You know what I should show you? That is what that looks like. See how dark it looks? But when you put it on, they're just not quite that dark. But yeah, I like this one. This one leans neutral. This leans a little rusty. I like the formula a lot. This is definitely a warmer color, but because it's got more depth to it, more darkness to it, I like it much better than the first one. I would wear this. I will wear this. I don't even know that I will wear the first one again. I don't think I would purchase this one because it is very warm. And you can tell my lips are gonna start getting redder as we do this just because I am such a sensitive self that as I take it off, it's gonna look a little bit more red. So this has enough color that I don't mind it. And I can see myself wearing it, especially maybe in the fall. I do love this formula though but I don't think I would purchase this color. And again, that was, this is what it looks like on me and that's what it looks like in the tin. See how much lighter it is? That's the tin of it. This is blue jeans. And just for the record, I was just reading inside the box and it says, at Hire, we have a modern take on the meaning of luxury. Higher luxury is meeting the highest verified standards of social and environmental impact accountability and transparency to become the first certified B Court luxury lipstick business. We innovate with bioavailable, organic, and clean ingredients to create fewer, better lip products and operate from a sustainable mindset at all costs. That just sounded like absolutely something I wanted to try and get behind because of, <laughs> starting to get a little red around the edges, because of all of the things we put on our face. Our lips is what we want to be the cleanest. Okay, our next one is called Lion. I wasn't sure where to put this in the lines. It looks just a skosh darker than the other one, but I think it's gonna lean 
a little warm also. I don't know if you can see that's it on the brush. Let's see what we have. This looks so much more natural on her. Okay, this falls again into the category of one that I would use because I own it and I will probably use it to gone. I don't know if I would buy it. Can you guys, is it coming across as warm as it feels? See, when I look at it at a distance, I kind of like it. But when I look at it up close, I think no. That is way, way too brown for me. It's almost like it's a brown that's trying to lean cool. So I'm trying to like it. Yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about this. I have it all over my teeth. I feel that way. I don't think it makes my teeth any browner. Mm. Let me know what you guys think. This one is called Lion Grr. And it's that darkness. All right, now we're getting to, I believe, are the two cool ones. And this is where I believe I will find the one that I want to order. So this is Truest. And that is what that looks like on the inside. I will happily say, I think they gave me the most of this one and I am super glad because I feel like it's one I'm gonna like. I don't know if that helps to see that at all. Oh yeah. This has kind of got a berry to it. And berry is where you guys know I like to live. I did not get enough. I want more of this. I like this a lot. This formula is fantastic. Yeah. That's me. That's me every day. That's very much like what I just took off, the Seattle London. This is the Apollo. I like it a lot. And if I could get it without the glitter in it, I would probably continue to buy it. I've almost finished it. That's the bottom of it. But it's very glittery. I don't know if that comes across in the videos, but I don't want that out there. Like I'm running to Target. Let's put on the glitter lips. But I do like the darker colors. So yeah, I like that a lot. That is totally... 100% where I like my lips to be just day to day. This is called Truest. It is absolutely a cool. And our last one that they send as part of the sample is our red. So we're gonna see whether it's an orange red or a blue red, or if they've managed to make it a neutral red. I'm making another video after this. <laughs> now that I'm doing this, it made me realize that I definitely, definitely should have done that one first. Can you guys see the red of that? That is the red. It's called Chiltern. And seeing it in person, I'm afraid it's gonna be an orange red, but let's see, we never know. Yeah. It is. I took too much too. I don't know, it's very pretty. Yeah, I just turned to do the other side and it's definitely a more orange red. And yet? There's something about it I really like. It's an orange red. There's no getting around it. It's an orange red. But there's something about it that I like. I feel kind of like it's whitening my teeth too. What do you guys think? Let me know what you think of this. Is it too orange for me? You guys are always so nice about that. But I do lean toward the blue reds because I'm so pink. But I kind of like that. Okay, here's what I learned from just trying it just once today. Truest is me. It is exactly what I look for. The one before this, exactly what I look for in a lipstick. It's a deep berry perfection. This Chiltern is a red. It's a red that had I seen it, just if I had been, say, at Nordstrom, walking down the aisle and I had seen that as a lipstick, I would have been like, there's no point in me trying that. It's too orange. Is it though? I like it. I thought I would switch back to the berry to make the other video that I have to make, and I don't think I am. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna stay in this. So this one was Chilter. First three were definitely more warm. So these lipsticks lean kind of warm. We had, I can't remember, what was the first one? We had Chateau, the second one was Blue Jeans, and the third one was Lion. These three definitely lean warm. This is your Cool Berry, and the red, I'm gonna go ahead and say I think it goes both ways. I think it could be used by people who do cool and people who do warm. I like it a lot. Kind of fun, right? I was instant influenced and I am glad. I will put a link to this down below. I'm in no way affiliated with them. They don't know I exist. When you go to their site, 
allow the pop-up to pop up. This is $23, I think, but you will get a pop-up that says you can have 10% off and that almost covers your shipping. I think shipping was like $3. So it was very reasonable and I got it so quick. I ordered it on Friday and I got it either Sunday or Monday. That quick. <laughs> Sorry, all of our lips. That was kind of fun. Okay, now the surprise I was talking about. It's been a while. Let's do a giveaway. So I just put a few things together. I had this cute lunchbox when I switched it up to change rooms. I got rid of some stuff. I moved some things around. I have this adorable, whoop, it's falling. I have this adorable little lunchbox, honestly, sitting right here right now. Don't remember who it was from. It has a bee on it, but there's nothing that helps me. It's just a nice little insulated lunchbox. I'll show you the giveaway. I just threw a few things together. If it's something that you're interested in, I'll cover the uh, giveaway rules at the end. Also, a cute little straw, a metal straw, with a cleaning brush to help keep it clean. We have this Dermalectives. This was in my Ipsy. It was my last month's boost. It was like $129 value. I decided to go ahead and pass it along as a lifestyle thing. And this one, I also thought I got these sunglasses. They are, they are, who are they? I have no idea about who they're by. I can't find any branding on them, but I thought they were super cute. They just don't look perfect on me. And we have this adorable little case. We have a Patchology Serve Chilled Rosé, two masks. We just received these Retinol Sika patches. They're like shamrock, so it seems perfect. We'll be doing this right now, right near almost St. Patrick's Day. We have the Ofra Signature Palette Luxe. I'll show you what this guy looks like real quick. That is what that looks like. It is very neutral. Those are eyeshadows, except for the one in the middle. They call a highlighter. We have the Commodity Milk in the bold. It's a sample size. The Lucky Chick Daydreams eyeshadow palette. So another eyeshadow palette. And that is what that looks like. Another one that's kind of neutral, but it had some shimmers in it. And I thought with the first one, other than that highlighter in the middle, you didn't really have shimmers. Then we have, we just had this. It is the Jasmine, it's the gel, brow gel the Peace Out Dark Spots Serum, a High Performance Hair Care Super Comb Prep and Protect, a Elta MD UV Daily SPF 40, a cute little Kabuki style brush, I think it's, yeah, Bella Pierre, a Dr. Brandt Micro Dermabrasion, sample sized, a Get Stuff Done, Crush Your Goal and Make It Happen, a tool for success notebook. So it's a little bit of what I would call lifestyle, skincare, and makeup. I'm gonna put it all together. I'm not sure if it'll all close in this, but it'll all fit in the box. That's the giveaway. If you have any interest in this, let's use the word lippy below because that'll make perfect sense because I'm gonna talk about these lippies and then it won't let everybody know that we're doing a giveaway. I really like my giveaways to be for you guys who sit through my videos and are here at the channel. I don't talk about it in the titles or in the thumbnails. I want it to be for you guys who watch the channel. I'm not using it to get new people over here. I just wanna thank you guys for being here. So. The giveaway rules. I will put a full list down below in case I go for this too quickly and you would like to check it out. You have to be subscribed to my YouTube channel, like this video, comment below, and we're gonna use the word lippy in the comment. I don't care how you spell it. I'll double check it. I won't rely on a computer to do that. You must have a US or Canadian address. This is gonna be heavy and expensive to ship. You must be 18 years or older. I will notify the winner and reply to their comment. Or if you follow me on InstaDM, if you wanna drop your Insta name in your comment, you're free to do that. I will let you know in DM and then it stays a little more private. You must have a public profile so I can see that you are subscribed. I will use random comment picker. They will just randomly pick a comment. That will be our winner as long as they meet all of the other qualifications. I will do that on this date. This is the date and the time that it closes. I can't tell you verbally right now because I'm not positive when I'm going to put this up and I want to be sure and give it at least a week. So look at the screen now if you're looking away. This is the date and the time that we're gonna close this. You have 48 hours after I contact you to get back to me or I will pick the next person. I'm always surprised how often that happens. I can't be responsible for the package once I've shipped it. Once the giveaway is over, if I have written your information anywhere, I will shred it. I will never, ever, 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 ever share your information with anyone, anything, any, anything, any company, I, I would never share your information. I may, however, make an announcement of the winner's name. I can just use your YouTube handle though. If you don't want me to say your real name, I can use your YouTube handle. I do that sometimes because people are like, do you really send the giveaways? I do. And this is in no way affiliated with YouTube, with anything that I just showed you, none of the companies, none of the anythings. 
This is from me to you, affiliated, supported by no one. It's just me. We'll also put a link down below that is a link that will take you over to the YouTube rules for giveaways in case you have any other questions. Again, I'll put it all down below. We we'll use the word lippy for the giveaway. Thank you so much for being here. I appreciate you taking the time to come over and check out the channel and good luck. Please like, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you'll know when I have more videos coming out. Oh, I've lost my lights. Must be time to go home. Have a great evening, guys. I'll see you soon.